there is a hidden stranded feature bug i'm not as actually sure but it's something that people did not know about for months and i'm the one who actually discovered it a, few, a while back and it's actually incredibly useful so as you can see behind me i have this mob farm and a mob farm is pretty cool you can you know get mobs spawn mobs whatever it can be useful for things if i were to say get a builder's wand and builders on the top of these and make them one tall it would only spawn spiders which can be useful for some things like say tarantula sayer maybe but something that i found out was you can actually make a lot of brood mothers spawn if you didn't know you can actually get brood mothers on stranded and it's about a one percent chance from any spider to spawn but i discovered while looking through some stranded leaderboards, I saw that some people had hundreds of broodmother kills. And what I did is I did a little bit of investigating and I visited their island. And I found out that their spider farm that they had, had a very specific difference from all the other spider farms. It was in a forest biome. So for some reason, if you set your biome to the forest biome, specifically, then for some reason, there is a very large amount of broodmothers that spawn. As you can see, there's already a broodmother right here. A lot of mobs aren't spawning because my water is a little bugged because when I rejoin, that can happen. So not very many mobs are spawning, but here's a broodmother right here. If it's a 1% chance, it might have taken me a bit longer to get a broodmother to spawn. I don't have a spider farm right now, but as you can see, a broodmother right there already. I'm going to cut the video so I can fix my farm and I'll just show you how many broodmothers can actually spawn here. It's insane. Okay, so I'm back and as you can see, there's a broodmother right here. And then if I go down just two more layers, another broodmother, two broodmothers and a single normal spider. Well, two normal spiders. So as you can see, it can spawn a lot. It can spawn a lot more if you have a specifically spider farm and you have all your things set so that spawn mobs only spawn here so that there's no mob cap but my island is a little messed up right now as you can see so it's not the best rates but currently i have a lot of broodmother kills the reason i killed so many broodmothers is because you can actually drop a tarantula pet from broodmothers and it took me a very long time to drop this tarantula pet but I actually finally did it after a long time. I believe I'm at over 1,000 <laughs> Broodmother kills. And if you look at the Broodmother kills leaderboard, like eight out of the top 10 players are stranded players, which is insane. But we don't have bestiary, so it doesn't affect those leaderboards. So it doesn't really matter that much. But I just thought this was neat. Subscribe.